Hello and welcome back to Randy's DIY. Today we have a Lenovo ThinkPad and this is a, probably can't see that, T580. Trust me, it's a T580. And on this particular unit, I have two batteries. <clears throat> one, which is removable from the outside, and then they have another one that's right under this portion of the uh, top cover. And when we log into this unit, it gives us an error message of, I believe it's battery two. I don't remember which one is one, which, if the external is one and this one's two, or which way they are. But it tells us that one of the batteries is uh, has a problem, uh, not detected. And I've removed the external battery and I still have the error. So I know it's the internal battery that has the problem. So today, I am going to show you how to get into this machine and replace that battery. So, powered it off. We'll start with flipping it upside down and removing the battery. Pull these little clips out, slide the battery back. Across the back of the unit, we have two. One right beside each uh, hinge. And these do not come out, they're anchored screws. We have two more in sort of the middle uh, area behind the battery. Right here, we have one in the center. And then we have two here, one on each side. Again, these are anchored screws, they don't come out. And then we have one in the center front. All right, so now we've got all of those released and we're gonna need most likely two tools. We need our little shovel that I like to use, and then we'll need a uh, sharp, you know, pry tool, and I'll show you what we're going to do with those. We're going to start in the rear corner. I like to stick this upside down. I like to start in the rear right corner. And we'll work our way right in between the top panel. It's a little thin piece. You'll see a line there the top area and the bottom cover. And we're just gonna work our way across there with our shovel, prying that up. And now we have that released. I've got my thumb uh, lifting up right here. And <clears throat> the issue you're gonna have is gonna be right along this line right here. And what you have to do, so prying up here, you'll see two little clip bars right here. We're gonna get right underneath those and to the side. We're gonna go in behind there and kind of give it a little pry out. That little clip is, will grab onto that back of the battery area and keep it from popping up. Okay, we have those removed. I'm gonna have to get in here with my shovel again and keep working our way around. Just work your way around this <clears throat> perimeter. Ah, here's something that was anchoring me. Always remember to remove the USB plugs. And pops right up. Now that we're in here, I'm gonna spin it around. You can see our battery right here. First thing we're gonna do is we'll take a sharp tool and on each side of the plug, there's a little lip there and you can put your tool on that and pry on each side until it slides out of there and then we're re released. This battery I think it has five screws in it. So we're gonna start in the stepper left corner, bottom left corner, bottom right corner, upper right corner, upper middle. And that should get us freed up. So now the battery should just lift right up out of there. This battery is a, you can see the part number there, and I will link in the description my Amazon affiliate link for you can uh, where you can find these batteries. I'll be right back. I'm going to grab a battery and we'll put a new one in. 
Okay, here we are back with our Amazon replacement battery. This is a no name. It's just a just a lithium ion battery from Amazon. And we're gonna set this back in here. We're gonna reapply the five screws we removed. Reinstall them. This is a PH1 Phillips bit, in case you're wondering. Most of the Lenovo products, uh, most of it uses a PH1. Sometimes you'll get into a zero one. And the last screw up here in the upper middle. Everything is there. And now we need to see if I can do this where you can see it. We're going to work our little connector back in to that slot and just give it a little push slide it right up in there and it uh, works great I always like to use and again I'll put this in the description uh, CRC QD electronic cleaner quick drying formula and wash out the, the fans on these things um, we'll let that hit it with a little compressed air if you have some and uh, dry that up real good it's a quick drying formula so really you don't have to it'll dry up in I don't know, 10 to 30 seconds i normally go ahead and pop while i get these out i'll pop the memory out and reseat it wipe it off and reseat it and uh, that's pretty much it we're we're all done i'm gonna button this bad boy back up Oops, that's what you're Give it a little light bump around the corners to snap all those little clips back in. Now we're going to go around and find all of our screws that we that we uh, loosened up earlier and tighten these back up. Once we get all these tight, we're going to snap our second battery back in. And that's pretty much all it takes to replace the battery in a T580 Lenovo laptop. These are dual battery laptops. And normally when I replace one of the batteries, I'll go ahead and replace both of the batteries. Uh, for this one, I'm not going to replace the external due to I've already replaced it before this video. So we'll open it back up, power it on. And we should be good to go. So there you go. I got the Lenovo screen. And I'm not going to go any further with this. Because I didn't show you the error that it had earlier. But this will fix this laptop. If you have the uh, battery error showing up on your laptop. Alright. Uh, good luck. I hope you learned something. Again, I'll put the uh, link to the CRC QD Cleaner. And a link to the... Uh, to the battery in my in the description under uh, with my Amazon affiliate link. Thanks a lot. Have a good day. God bless you.